Managing both client and office accounts can be complex for law firms, but SQL accounts simplifies the process by integrating both into a single. Law firms typically manage two types of accounts. Office account contains all funds belonging to the firm, including earned fees, operating funds, and payments received for agreed services. Client account holds deposits made by clients, which the law firm manages on their behalf. These funds are used for payments to local authorities, tax agents, professional fees, and other client-related expenses. Client funds must be kept separate from the office account to ensure proper financial management. SQL account simplifies account management by combining client and office accounts into a single streamlined system using customer deposit. Customer deposits can be applied in two key scenarios. Customer payment, apply deposits to invoices once services are rendered, reducing outstanding balances. Deposit refund, apply the deposit refund when the law firm disburses funds to the seller or other relevant parties upon transaction completion, as per the agreement terms. Now, let's go through the process in SQL accounting. Customer deposits are collected and placed in a trust account, separate from the firm's operational funds, for future disbursements. Steps to record a customer deposit. Navigate to Customer, Customer Deposit. Click New. Select the customer code and adjust the document date if needed. The deposit account will default to prepay cost, but as our system allows multiple prepayment accounts, you may select the appropriate one. Next, choose the bank account receiving the deposit. If applicable, enter any bank charges or check number. Enter the deposit amount, for instant 100,000 ringgit. Then, click Save. For the double entry accounting, the transaction will be recorded as debit, bank account, credit prepayment deposit account, which are current liability. Since this is a deposit, it will not be recorded under the customer account at this stage. Once services are provided, a sales invoice is issued for legal fees, reimbursements, disbursements, and other charges. A sample law firm invoice template in SQL account follows a standard structure, ensuring clarity and accuracy in billing. The invoice includes essential references. Your reference, the client's case number. Our reference, the law firm's internal reference number. It also itemizes charges under categories such as total legal services, reimbursement, disbursement, and other charges. At the footer, the invoice provides a clear breakdown of the total amount excluding tax, total service tax and the grand total, including tax. When an invoice is issued, the outstanding balance can be offset using the customer deposit. Steps to apply a customer deposit to an invoice. Navigate to Customer, Customer Payment. Click New. And select the Customer Code. Next to Customer Code, click the From Deposit drop-down to select the deposit. The system will automatically apply the deposit to this payment. The received in account will change to prepay us deposit account instead of a bank account. Adjust the payment amount to match the invoice amount. Knock off the invoice. Then, click Save. For the double entry accounting, the transaction will be recorded as Debit, Prepayment Deposit Account, which are current liability, credit, customer control account. Using deposit refund when a law firm disburses funds to the seller or other relevant parties upon transaction completion, as per the agreement terms. Steps to process a deposit refund. Navigate to Customer, Customer Deposit and open the deposit entry. Ensure it is in save mode. Then click the plus sign at the bottom. Select Deposit Refund. The maximum refundable amount will be displayed. Choose the cash or bank account for the refund. Enter the refund amount, which can be either a partial or full refund. Select the project, area, and agent, if applicable, and enter the check number, if required. Click OK to save. For the double entry accounting, the transaction will be recorded as Debit, prepayment deposit account. Credit, bank account. This step reduces the deposit amount accordingly. SQL account provides a default prepayment deposit account, but law firms handling multiple trust accounts may require additional accounts. Steps to create additional prepayment deposit accounts. Navigate to GL, Maintain Account. Under Current Liability, click New. Enter the GL code. Add a description. Tick Special Account Type. Select Deposit Account. 
click OK. Now, your additional prepayment account is set up. SQL account makes managing client and office accounts simple and efficient by using customer deposits to handle payments and refunds, all within one system. Eliminate manual tracking, ensure accurate financial records and streamline deposit management. Ready to simplify your law firm's accounting? Get started with SQL accounting today. Subscribe to our YouTube for the latest video, follow our Facebook for the latest update, go to our website for reports and guides. It's so easy.